State finalists moving out on the 500. Lane one is Catherine Rowe, Schenectady, Saratoga. Two, Margaret Denichenzo, Crimson Aquatics. Three, Sammy Harshberger, Metro Aquatics. Four, Morgan Dixon, Patriot Aquatic Club. Five is Casey Francis, unattached. Six, Megan Purdy, Boulder City Henderson. Seven, Anna Mayfield, Alamo area. Eight, Meredith Oliver, Metro. Once again, coaches, you're reminded you have relays or individual swimmers that place fourth through eighth. You need to pick up your awards uh, this evening at the award staging area. Thank you. So it was Morgan Dixon leading him out at the 100 at 54.52. She came in with the fastest seat time into the seat final at 452.38. Coaches take note, 10 minutes from now will be your scratch deadline for tomorrow's event. 5.30 is the deadline, and we're approaching 5.20. So it's Morgan Dixon and Anna Mayfield. Anna representing Alamo Area Aquatic Association just down the road in San Antonio. And these are your top two as they approach the 200. And they are right together, 153-3 on both ladies. We'll note that Anna Mayfield out splitting Morgan Dixon by just over a tenth of a second on that previous 50. Pretty good battle for the number three spot behind these leaders. They've got some work to do if they want to try and run down your top two. Morgan Dixon at 222.8, 29.5, her split. Same thing for Mayfield, also at 29.5. And these ladies are much faster in terms of splits than this morning. We'll see if they can get home. Moving up in lane two, that is Marga Denichenzo of Crimson. 252-3 at that turn for Morgan Dixon as they move past the 300. <laughs> 16 year old Morgan Dixon of Patriot in control here at the 350. 321, 629, three for both her and Mayfield. Dinachenzo off the pace a bit, splitting a 29-5. There in lane five, you've got Casey Francis, unattached, trying to move up and challenge. Morgan Dixon trying to break away from Anna Mayfield. She's got it out to nearly a body length. 100 yards to go for your leader, 351-2 and a 29-5. Mayfield, 351-8 and a 29-7. Coming up quickly is Casey Francis there in lane five. Got an awful lot of work to do, though, as she wants to get by Margaret Dinachenzo. Still Morgan Dixon as the bells will come up, indicating 50 yards to go at this turn. Dixon goes 29-6 on that 50. Morgan Dixon now racing for the win. This morning was 452.38. And tonight trying to go under 450, and she does. 449.55 for Morgan Dixon. Second, Mayfield of Alamo area, 450.35. Francis third at 450.97.